Welcome to Fun Islamic Facts, where I share fun facts about Muhammad and the Quran whenever jihadis go on a killing spree. Do you like the adorable gecko from the Geico commercials? If so, you're going to hell, because Muhammad hated lizards and ordered his followers to kill them. Sunan Abu Daud, number 5262. It was narrated from Amr bin Sa'd that his father said, The Messenger of Allah enjoined killing geckos, and he called them noxious little creatures. Muhammad even said that Muslims will be rewarded in paradise for killing geckos, with bonuses for efficiency. Sunan Abu Daud, number 5263. It was narrated that Abu Huraira said, The Messenger of Allah said, Whoever kills a gecko with the first blow, he will have such and such of hasana. Hasana here refers to good deeds for which you'll be rewarded. Whoever kills it on the second blow, he will have such and such of hasana less than the first. Whoever kills it on the third blow, he will have such and such of hasana less than the second. But geckos are fairly harmless creatures and they help reduce the insect population so we may be wondering why Muhammad would want them killed. Fortunately for us, the Prophet of Islam explained his hatred for lizards. Sahih al-Bukhari, number 3359. Narrated Um Sharik, Allah's Messenger ordered that house lizards should be killed and said, it, i.e. the house lizard, blew the fire on Ibrahim, i.e. Abraham. The commentator adds a note for clarification. When Abraham was thrown into the fire, it is said, all the animals tried to extinguish the fire, except the house lizard, which blew it. So, when Abraham was thrown into the fire, which never happened, various animals gathered around and tried to put out the fire. But lizards conspired to kill Abraham by blowing on the fire and making it hotter. Hence, lizards are under a death sentence to be carried out by Muslims. As for you Muslims who don't believe in killing lizards for their attempted execution of Abraham, keep in mind that the prophet who delivered this revelation about lizards is the same prophet who delivered the Quran.